It's called the digital divide. Those who can work well with computers and those who can't. News Channel 5's Brandis Hudson tells us now about a group of young people who have crossed that divide and now have the skills to face the constantly changing technology. A newfound feeling of accomplishment for 17-year-old Tiana Price. I felt overwhelmed by it. it just touched me how, how proud they were of us. Today, she became one of several graduates from the Comcast Digital Connectors program. At the Palm Beach Photographic Center, a sense of pride in the room, so strong, tears wouldn't subside. One of my girls had me crying. You know, it's, uh, it's good. It's a great feeling to know that you done or have actually affected someone's life that much. Awesome. <laughs> they really no words can describe how I feel because otherwise we wouldn't have had this opportunity and we have been struggling like a lot of other people that we know. The program focuses on minorities and teens from low-income families. Even out the playing field because now we've conquered that digital divide. The six-month class gives hands-on training with broadband technology. We're starting to send a message that here in West Palm Beach we are educating our young people to be able to fill the jobs of the future. Students also had lessons in leadership, financial literacy, and civic journalism. Today, teens showcased their major multimedia project, an e-book. The name of the book is called The Loudest Silence, and as you can see, it features all sorts of short stories and poems, all produced by the students. And that's not all. They've been charged to take the knowledge they've gained and share it with others. Teens staying connected and changing communities. Brandis Hudson, WPTV News Channel 5.